Hey guys, bringing you another do-it-yourself computer repair video today. I have an ASUS computer that I'm working on and I'm going to show you how to adjust the problem of if you're trying to start your computer and it gives you a series of beeps and then doesn't start. Um, most often these are beep codes. Uh, this computer beeps in a pattern that kind of lets us know what, what's wrong with it. Now the vast majority of, of beep codes you're going to see, um, groupings of three or, or four beep codes, in my experience most of them have to do with faulty RAM or some sort of RAM issue. So in this video I'm going to show you how to address that most common beep code issue of, of RAM. Uh, if your beep codes are, are not in that pattern or if you think you have another pattern that's not addressed by RAM, uh, I will leave in the description below uh, other beep codes that ASUS gives that I see my viewers um, uh, comment on. And so as I help people with various different beep codes, I'll add them there. So check the, the description for the beep codes and if you don't see yours there and if you don't see a resolution, uh, message me in the comments and I'll try to figure out what's wrong with your particular beep code. So to access your RAM, first thing you want to do is flip the computer over. Now if your computer is like mine, you may have an access panel here or an easy access door that gives you access to uh, commonly used components like your hard drive and your RAM. If you're lucky like me, you have it. If you don't, you'll have to take off your entire bottom panel. Um, if you have to do that, make sure to remove your battery first if, if you have a removal battery like I do. Uh, double check for screws under there. Double check for screws under your DVD case and double check for screws under your rubber feet. Um, to be super safe, if you want to look for a disassembly video on your specific model, uh, th that would help giving you an idea of how to access the inside of your computer. But I'm just going to take my easy, pan my easy access panel off here. There you go. So there's my hard drive and there's my RAM. So I'm going to zoom in on the RAM here for you. So this is a pretty typical presentation of, of RAM. Uh, in your computer you may see them on top of each other, you may see them side to side, or you may only have one RAM slot. If you only have one RAM slot, you'll have to buy another stick of good RAM to do this test. Um, in, in my case here, I, I have two, and, and most of you should have two. But what we're going to do is RAM is kind of like headlights on a car. It's possible that they've both gone bad at once, but it's very unlikely. So we're going to try to test between which stick is, is good. So RAM is held in most commonly by two spring-loaded arms. Pull those apart and the RAM should pop up. Like that. And then it just slides out. Well, like that. So you take your RAM out, try starting your computer again. If it starts up normally, you've identified the bad stick of RAM. Uh, check the video link below in the description on how to buy compatible RAM. Because just because it physically fits into your port doesn't mean that it's compatible with your computer. Um, so make sure you get the right RAM if, if you are replacing it. If this uh, doesn't help your computer start up, then we'll try the other stick of RAM. So we're going to take this one out. We'll put that other one back in. And now we'll try to start the computer up with just that stick of RAM. And again, if your computer starts, you've identified the faulty stick. So again, that's a pretty easy way to deal with the most common beep codes you'll see in an ASUS computer, which have to do with a bad stick of RAM. Again, if you're getting a different beep code, check the frequently asked questions. Uh, see if your beep code is there. If it's not, let me know what kind of pattern you're seeing and I can help you with how to fix it. Uh, so please like and share if this is helpful. Uh, subscribe if you enjoy do-it-yourself computer work. Thanks for watching guys.